Today we're going to be returning to my Hypixel Skyblock Island after three years of inactivity. I haven't played since around 2019, and I've had this Hypixel account for six years, so I have some experience on the server, but I haven't played Skyblock in a really long time. Stopped playing right before the release of Skyblock actually back in the day, and it came back about two years ago when I started watching all of Technoblade's videos. I started playing it, but then fell off a bit because I got a bit bored. I was turned off by the fact that there's so much has changed between each update, so I felt kind of turned off about coming back, and I wanted to show what it's like coming back to the game after being off for so long. So I did what I do best, fired upstream, and started making a fool of myself. So yeah, I, um, I'm trying to go to the end, because I've been following, like, uh, if you've been gone for this long, here's the guide that you follow when you come back. And it has been a hell of a time trying to find where the end is. I don't know how to get to the end. I never... I'm guessing it's this way. Oh, is this it right here? Yeah. Let's go! I found it! Team C, look at me! Back on Twitch, I had to- oh shit, I'm going back to Spider's Den. Finally arrived in the end thanks to a couple of chatters telling me exactly where to go. I got right down to business, slacking down Enderman as fast as humanly possible, but I quickly found out that my defense stat was not cutting it. Level 42, eh? Maybe that's the reason I shouldn't be doing this. Why well, just got clapped, dude? Thankfully, after I got murked by a couple of Endermen, I finally decided to listen to my chat and go get some better armor. The only thing is, is I had no idea what to buy. Again, thanks to chat being so nice and all the people that were coming into the stream, which I thank YouTube for actually giving me these people to help me out. The Hypix community has been absolutely fantastic so far, and what they did is got me on the right track to getting some good armor. Goblin these nuts. Goblin boots. I was going to put goblin toes. I don't think anybody wants to see goblin toes. Can't afford the bid. What am I poor? <laughs> Fortunately and unfortunately, I don't think I ever actually ended up using this armor in any fights or anything like that because some really nice people came in from chat and started giving me items and donating things to make my experience a little bit better and kind of streamline my entire Hypixel Skyblock experience so I can get back to doing exactly what I like to do beating Enderman down. After accepting some gifts from some extremely nice chatters, thank you guys again for helping me out and getting started back into Hypixel Skyblock again, I decided to accept a trade offer to give this guy my armor so he can go enchant it, which obviously never do this if you don't know anybody, they could definitely 100% scam you and just take your stuff and run, but you know, I had a backup set of armor, I was feeling pretty good about it, and I got a great set of armor back and I was finally ready, like I said, to go back in and wreck some Enderman down. And now it's time to grind to the end of time. I remember exactly what they told me to grind for but i feel like you guys know a whole lot and you seem to be people who are playing on the server way more than the guy that um trying to help me so say i haven't been playing for a, a long time like i'm talking a few years what should i right now as somebody who has all of this stuff what should I be going for? After listening to some suggestions from chat after a couple of minutes, I decided that I was going to go down and listen to them and go kill some zealots to try to get summoning eyes. Summoning eyes sell for 800,000 coins, and they told me I should grind up those to get Hyperion, which is one of the best swords in the game apparently at this point, but at the time of recording, it cost about a billion coins to get, and I was very, very far away from that. Unfortunately, I did a lot of grinding off stream after it ended and found that I got zero summoning eyes, and it wasn't really great, but then I remember the guide that I was watching previously. I decided that I was going to go in and get the dragon armor set, which is apparently a better set in the game, especially if I'm going to be down here killing zealots. The only issue with that is that I couldn't one-shot zealots at all, so I needed to grind up a lot of strength, a lot of combat experience, and everything else to get up to be able to one-shot zealots, farm summoning eyes to then summon the dragon to get a bunch of good armor and sets and everything like that. But what I didn't understand is that other people could also summon the dragon and bring him down so we could fight them. And I ended up getting a couple dragon armor fragments, but not even close to enough to a full set of armor, so I had a lot of grinding ahead of me. I am getting a bit ahead of myself on here, but I decided for the next hour I was going to grind for summoning eyes by killing zealots as many as possible. There were a lot of people going around one-shotting them, so it was really hard to do so, so I tried to find some different hubs that didn't have people doing it, but unfortunately almost all of them had it, because this is a very, very popular idea to make money, so I had to do what I did best and just absolutely smack down these endermen as fast as humanly possible before anybody else could get to them. Unfortunately, after an hour of hunting and grinding, I got literally zero eyes, so I finally decided to call it for the day and stop grinding for the summoning eyes and decided to do it a little bit off stream later, which again, I got zero from that as well. I actually had at this time of recording after doing three streams, I've got zero, literally zero summoning guys. So it's going to be a long grind ahead. What I decided to do instead was go visit some fewer islands and check out some of the nice builds everyone had. And these builds are insane. I never ex expected all of these people to have all of these really crazy builds on here. And I also decided to play a little bit of parkour, which this guy's parkour was literally just two blocks start to finish to try to get the lowest time possible. And I landed second on the leaderboard. So if you think you could beat my time, I don't care about the first guy. If you can beat my time, go check out the island. I think his name was on the island somewhere there, and you can check it out and try to beat my parkour score. 
At the end of the day, I learned when you come back to Hypixel Skyblock after a long time away, you need to have a one-track mind and focus on one thing so you don't get overwhelmed by all of the possibilities of things you can do, find one item to grind for, and go on that track until you complete it. I'm really happy that the community was so nice and helped me get back on my feet and taught me all of the new things and tried to be as nice as possible getting me back into all of this because I was very confused about all of the terminology and everything that comes into this. It was a big boomer experience for me and I feel very old now. I am again happy to say that the Hypixel community is absolutely fantastic right now. If you need any help with it, I guarantee that people are going to be out there to try to help you. Again, thank you guys so much for watching, getting a daily dose of vitamin P. If you guys want more daily doses of vitamin P, please check out the rest of the videos on the channel listed down below and on the end card screen in a couple of seconds here. Uh, we do have a Discord as always linked down in the description as well. I'm now streaming on YouTube every few days now, doing a high pixel stuff. I might even be live right now if you're checking it out. Probably not, but I might be live if you go check it out right now. Join the Discord, streams on YouTube, and streams are probably going to actually end up moving to the weekends very soon, so keep a lookout on those. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, getting your daily dose of vitamin P. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, and take care.